This is Nigel from Apex Plumbing and Heating. We've set up a little test rig here to demonstrate the performance boost with an accumulator under the correct circumstances. Here we have the incoming water main coming in through here, isolation valve, then the pressure gauge of the incoming main, which is now just over four bar. Then we have a check valve here, which is a one-way valve. Another pressure gauge, which is showing the same pressure as the other gauge, which is just over four. This is just a blank. Again, another blank there. Those are for attaching various accessories. Again, another one there. Then we have a, a great water accumulator here. It's a small one just for demonstration purposes and that is connected in to the main pipe work there at the bottom and the system is currently filling up so that pressure is slowly rising the mains pressure here is about four and a half maybe five bar so it is increasing very very slowly but we're pretty much there so what we've done now is isolated the accumulator so that blue lever here is in the off position, so the great water accumulator is isolated. So that is not connected in to the existing pipework. What we can do now is open one of these valves and then that will show you the mains pressure and flow directly from the mains without the benefit of an accumulator. There we go, that's the flow rate directly off the mains. You see the pressure gauges have dropped down to zero as the water is just flowing straight through from the incoming main, through the pipework, through the check valve and straight out. The accumulator is switched off. So if I now open the accumulator, you'll see the difference. That's the pressure in the system, it's currently at two bar. So that's with the accumulator. If I now switch that off, again we're just back to the normal incoming flow rate. Pressure is down to zero, as the water is just flowing straight through. If I now switch off the outlet, which could be a shower, a bath, a basin, anything. Switch that off. Now the water, the pressure will start climbing. So I now need to open the accumulator. And the water is now recharging the accumulator. So that pressure gauge will show the increase in pressure, pressure as it fills up. And that will stop at the static pressure which as I say is it's about four and a half or five bar. If while that's charging, we decide to use another tap or shower, then again, we've still got the improved flow rate with what's left in the accumulator.
without the accumulator. It's the normal flow rate off the mains. We've got about 20 litres per minute here at a pressure of, as I say, four and a half to five bar with the accumulator. without.